Hello, and welcome to a quick instructional video I wanted to put together. Um, this is just kind of spur of the moment. I've been considering doing this video, but I haven't actually put it together, put any thought into it, so hopefully this is not as scattered as it seems in my mind. <laughs> so th this video, I plan to show you how to go full alpha, no scripts for events such as Monthly Midnight Mania, which is what I'm standing around waiting on. <laughs> I'm waiting on the noon round to start. So um, in this event, um, if you're in the groups particularly, you'll find a lot of people recommending that you go full alpha, drop your script count. Um, that way it's easy for you to get in and out. It's easy for other people to get in and out, and people don't have to render you. People don't have to... Um, bear your script load or whatever. I'm not too sure how all that works, but I do know that avatar complexity and script count are two different things. And as you can see, I already have my avatar complexity showing because I've already attempted this video a couple other times. <laughs> because, you know, quick spur of the moment really is the way to go on things. So go up to avatar tab, go to avatar health, and show avatar complexity information. Put a check next to that line and then you'll get a number over your head. 55k to me is is reasonable, it's acceptable. I would probably render somebody at 55k. I have my general settings up to 180k because I like to see people and if I'm lagging I can turn it down. Um, anyways, <clears throat> so once you have your number, you know, uh, basically, it gives you a little bit more information about how much it costs to render your avatar to yourself and other people. And your script count um, is basically, um, it affects other people, but not through graphical imaging. It's through, I guess, probably through bandwidth. Um, I am not the smartest person when it comes to this kind of stuff, so I'm probably not using the right terms, but it, you know, it just affects how you, um, it affects you and other people when you have a lot of scripts and you have a high complexity count. Things that contribute to a high complexity are usually hair and jewelry. Um, a lot of uh, the older jewelry that I have seems to have very high complexities. Um, I think I have a necklace that's almost 200k by itself, so it's very common, not common, but I have seen people, you know, between 500k and 800k, you know, just walking around in the world like there's nothing wrong, and their computer may be able to handle it, but maybe not the people around them at these crowded events where tons of people are trying to get in, and there's TP hammering being used, and it's just the sim is being overloaded with all kinds of requests, and anyways, I'm just babbling, so let's get on to how to how to get to full alpha, no script, avatar. First of all, you want to get full alpha. Go to your inventory and go down to library, and this is if you don't already have a full alpha um, mask. Go down to body parts here, alpha mask, and invisible avatar. I just double click it. You can right click and wear whatever you do. I double clicked it and it will be in my clothing folder now. And of course there are two of them because I've already tried this. So you already have an invisible avatar alpha and you're wearing it. Now you need to just start taking everything off. So you can just manually start you know, taking things off, detach, detach, detach. You can go over here to your worn tab in your inventory. It can expand it and then just start detaching things from there. You can also right click yourself, go to appearance and edit outfit. And then from here to attachments and clothing and you can start taking things off from here too. So I'm going to go ahead and remove everything I'm wearing, and I'll pause the video so it doesn't, you know, you don't need to watch me taking off all my clothes. <laughs> and um, I'll be right back. Okay, I just went through here uh, in my worn tab and removed everything. I did leave a couple of things on so that we can cover one more small detail. So there, there you have it. I am 
completely alpha zero complexity and of course there are some things that you cannot take off you can't take off your shape you can't take off your skin um, you can't take off your eyes at least I don't think you can nope and you can't take off your hair base and you need to make sure you have this invisible avatar worn so there I am, fully alpha I do know that some people have collars and things that they're unable to remove. Just the, the, the goal is, is to get your complexity as low as possible and get it under 50K because I think that's probably the threshold that the orbs are kicking for. And so here I am at zero. Okay, so script count. Um, to get your script count, oh, I can't see myself right now, so let me turn my name tag on. To get your script count, you can right-click yourself and go to Script Info. And it says here, Mary Jane Earp, 16 of 16, running scripts, 544 kilobytes, blah, blah, blah. I don't know if that's high or low. All I know is that I need to get it as low as I possibly can. And the way to do that is, well, it's most likely going to be your HUDs since you're not wearing anything on your body, so start detaching your HUDs. Um, I probably should leave, put that back on <laughs> so I can show you how to find, um, let me put that back on really fast. Because uh, this is the thing where a lot of people will be like, I'm still running scripts. I have a lot of scripts. What's happening? I can't find what's doing this. So a lot of times it's something you have attached to your HUD or something that's still attached to your body, which I don't have right now. So uh, to find out how to find out your script or to find out what is running scripts on you. OK, sorry. Let me word that correctly. Um, you go up here to world and then parcel details. You can also get this. Um, the same window by just clicking on the bar at the very top that has the address of um, where you're at up on the toolbar. So you click that and you get about land. And down here in the left hand um, corner is script info. Click on that. And then you want to click on avatar. And here you will see what you have on that's running scripts. And then you can detach it. So that's just to find out what's on you that's running a script and then you can go over here and find it, detach it. And now I don't have any scripts running. Refresh list. Uh, I do have that Firestorm bridge. I'm not too sure if you can actually get rid of that or not. Um, let me see if I can. Well, no, I don't think. Let's see, I already have a full alpha, no script. And I guess you can take that off for that. I don't know. Oh, I'm going to do it, I guess. <laughs> um, avatar. Take off my bridge. Uh, I don't know. Okay, well, anyways, I might just cut that part out because I don't know if you can do that or not. Anyway, so that's how to find your script count and how to get it to zero, how to get your arc down to zero or as close to it as possible. And then once you have this, this little outfit, go down to right-click yourself, go to Appearance, Edit Outfit, and then Save As, and save it as your own little uh, full alpha, no script event, um, outfit. So yeah, I'm sorry if this was a little bit scattered, but I did want to put this together to maybe help somebody out there that is struggling with figuring out why your complexity isn't lower or why you're getting kicked. So anyways, um, how much time did I pass before mid Midnight Mania noon round starts? <laughs> I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm ready. Um, so yes, uh, enjoy your weekend, have a good time making sure you're fully alpha and scriptless and enjoy your events and have fun and be good.